this is my guide to the 6 hole at Roll Drone, a 601 yard par 5. You need an arrow straight drive to thread your way between the bunkers left and right of the fairway, while two more line wait further down. The long and narrow green, meanwhile, is beautifully framed by sand dunes on each side. To have any chance of reaching the green in two, you need to be an enormous hitter or hope you're playing it downwind. To get close, most will lay up on the right hand side, hoping to tuck it up by the pin and walk away with a birdie. This is a 405 yard par 4. After six holes on the coast, we swing inland from an elevated tee sitting proudly on the dunes. The fairway sharply doglegs to the right with a sand hill and bunker making the angle even trickier. There's a small gully short of the green that is protected by a bunker on each side. The pear shaped putting surface is set between two more sand hills. If the pin is at the front of the green, you may have to pitch the ball in front and hope for a friendly bounce off the upslope to escape with your par. This is one of the great par threes in golf and the signature hole at Royal Troon, known as the postage stamp and feared by many. If you missed the famously small target, you will probably find yourself in one of the treacherous bunkers. You especially don't want to end up in the famous coffin bunker to the left. Getting away without a drop shot or worse is the target here. Get your three and move on. <laughs>